Hello everyone, hope you're doing well. Today it's time to have a look at the special new year in War Thunder, or basically the sales which are going to be happening over the Christmas period and the New Year period, and also some of the events that Gaijin are putting on. There's a lot of cool stuff which is going on over the next, uh, well, I suppose few weeks or so, so make sure to get involved in any way that you want to, just so you can get uh, access to some really cool stuff. So get, to get started, we have the everyone get some gifts. And this is a new set of challenges for some pretty cool little things. A new thing in War Thunder is coming. Animated decorations. We've never had animated decorations before, and what they're doing is they're coming in for ships. So you can now actually get decorations for your ships. It's not just going to be a tank thing anymore. Now ships will get some cool decorations. And also, they're doing a new aerobatic smoke. This is the first time I think in a long time we've actually got a new aerobatic smoke. This is the smoke that you can turn on uh, for planes. It comes out obviously of the tips of your wings and if you have the tricolor smoke the center mount as well and you just have to complete these little challenges from December 28th to January 4th so it's not available yet but it will be soon. You basically have a week to be able to complete these. So to get the new year aerobatic smoke which basically looks like a, uh, well, I suppose an ice, uh, ice smoke with a little bit of icicles in it, or, you know, uh, you, you have obviously the parts of the ice in it, which is pretty cool. And, uh, then you have, you need to defeat 30 enemy players while controlling aircraft of rank three or higher. You'll generally do this anyway, if you're doing the, uh, operation winter task. So, uh, you know, you can get along with that and have a bit of fun with it and uh, you basically get a little bit of an additional thing on top of it which is really nice and then you got the sparkler and the sparkler is one of these new animated decorations uh, that they've talked about so you have to defeat 30 enemy players while controlling ground vehicles of rank three or higher so hopefully when you put this on your vehicle you'll be able to sparkle uh, like a beautiful star and hopefully it'll look awesome um, i'm really looking forward to it so then we've got a snowman uh, that you can can get as a decoration i believe this is a naval one and you have to defeat five enemies with torpedoes while controlling coastal vessels of rank two or higher this one might be a little bit harder uh, because generally i get my torpedo kills through aircraft but uh, i'm sure it can be done and uh, i believe in you you'll be able to get it and you get a cool snowman with a wonderful bucket on his head if you want to actually see the snowman in game uh, you can actually see it in the hangar right now in the festive hangar that's available and then in the blue water ships you need to inflict 50,000 damage while controlling them uh, from rank two or higher and you get yourself a nice new year tree so these are some nice things alongside of the operation winter which is already going on so you can get yourself some extra little things alongside it so that's wonderful it's always nice to see decorations it's always nice to see new aerobatic smoke and the fact that this is the first one we've seen which is new in maybe about four to five years and then on top of that as well animated decorations it makes me really really happy to see what happens in the future when it comes to war thunder not just for these events with animated stuff but stuff like profile pictures like can you imagine an animated profile picture that would be really really cool and it's something that they already do in cross out and i hope it gets brought over to war thunder then of course you have operation winter which is going on right now we've obviously talked about it quite a lot if you want any more information information on Operation Winter. I've done a little playlist for you uh, with all of the information about it with the vehicles and with the dev blogs and also with uh, how to do it, tips and tricks, all of that good stuff. So make sure to check that out so you can get access to the MiG-21, the Class 3 and the USS Baltimore. Even if you start today, you should, uh, well, you won't be able to get everything unless you buy one of the stars for each of them, but you'll be pretty damn close uh, so make sure to check that out and then the big one discounts everybody loves discounts everybody loves stuff like that and as you can see it starts today so from the from the 23rd of december to the 28th of december they are doing 50 percent off 
pretty much everything. So 50% off all vehicles in the game. <laughs> and also 50% off talismans, backups, and modifications. And then 50% off premium accounts for 90 or 365 days in the game store. Or 180 days in the Gaijin.net online store. As I've said many times, your best investment when it comes to War Thunder. And your best bang for your buck is picking up premium time at 50%. Off the 365 days uh, only costs, I believe, around $35. That is basically two uh, meals or three like McDonald's meals. It's a hell of a pickup for a whole year of premium. What uh, premium does is it doubles the amount of research that you get in every uh, in every circumstance in every battle that you play, and it basically two and a half times the amount of SL you get as well from battles. So it is definitely definitely something that you should pick up. It is much more useful than getting an individual vehicle. It is much more useful than everything else in the game if what you are worried about is either SL or RP. It is the way to go when it comes to uh, War Thunder. I've seen a lot of people uh, talk about, you know, they don't know what to buy this Christmas event. You know, maybe they've got a bit of Steam, you know, money or, you know, maybe they've got something saved up. This is it. This is the one to buy. If you don't buy anything else, get this and you'll uh, realize how much SL you can make, how much RP you can make and all of that good stuff. So make sure to check this out in game, in game, you know, you can find it in the top right hand corner. And then if you want, you can get the 180 days of Gaijin.net uh, online store that costs about $20. Uh, so basically two hours of work, at least where I'm from. So it's, it's just a really good pickup. And then if you want specific uh, talismans or if you want specific vehicles in game, guess what? They're 50% off too. But before anything, get this if you're going to get anything please. Uh, so I don't have to constantly hear about people having SL issues, people having RP issues. This is easily the best thing to ever buy when it comes to War Thunder. Now, unfortunately, when it comes to these uh, updates, normally what happens is the last few updates don't count. Uh, so they're not included in the discount. And that includes Raining Fire, New Power, and also Hot Tracks. So none of these are able to uh, non of the vehicles out of these will be subject to this stuff but that is completely fine you know it, it happens at the end of the day um that uh, that is the case so you know we we kind of expect that the discounts for those will probably start in the summer or next uh, anniversary sale and then they're also going to be doing gadget.net sales between the 28th till the 4th of january up to 50 percent off for gadget.net store goods now when uh, this is available on the 28th i'll make sure to make a video on it because i'm sure they'll do some new packs or they'll do some bundles or combos uh, so i'll make sure to keep you guys informed about that stuff uh, but at least right now we don't have any details on what packs are going on offer uh, so instead of you know uh, spending your money on that make sure to get this for the love of god please <laughs> and the next thing is some social media contests. So they're doing some social media contests from the 24th of December to the 8th of January. And basically what you have to do is create a winter themed vehicle camo, uh, ship, tank, plane or helicopter, upload it to War Thunder Live and uh, make a social media post about it as well with the hashtag WTChristmas2020 and then just follow the rules. Uh, it's pretty much as simple as that. And if you get uh, first place, you get access to either a Yak-38, T-72 AV Terms, or a Prince Eugen pack, plus a New Year trophy. Then second place gets the MiG-17 AS, the Avery, the PGO-2, and a New Year trophy. And then third place gets one of the starter packs, and also the New Year trophy, which is pretty cool. Then you've got the 10 judges prizes, uh, which gets a New Year trophy, which is a random decoration and a random decal. Then you can get basically some of the old stuff, uh, which, uh, you know, which they've done in previous Christmas events. And also you get Santa's little helper as a title, which is something we saw before. They're also bringing back Capture the Flag, uh, but 
Christmas edition. Uh, so basically what you have to do is you have to pick up uh, the uh, Christmas presents from the middle of the map while trying to, you know, annihilate everybody as you go, bring it back to your Christmas tree, and uh, therefore you get a point. I believe you need three points to win. Um, it's a pretty fun little game mode, and uh, they are getting... Uh, they are getting well if if you basically win a uh win one of these uh battles either festive delivery or just festive events in general uh then you get access to the uh you get access to the special metal ball decal which i don't really think is very festive they say it's festive here uh, which is kind of funny, but I'm not entirely sure if I would class this as a festive decal. <laughs> oh, I mean, it, you know what I think Happy New Year? I don't think this. Uh, you know, it's pretty much as simple as that. But that is what's going on uh, for New Year in War Thunder. There's a lot of wonderful stuff going on. A lot of great things. Uh, a lot of wonderful things. Make sure to take advantage of the sales. Make sure to take advantage of the events that are going on. I'm going to be streaming uh, a decent amount of it, so if you want to check it out, make sure to go to the Twitch channel uh, so you can have a look. And as always, uh, thank you all for watching. Have a wonderful day, and I'll see you next time. I'd just like to thank John Ryman, Universe, Conte Baraka, E Love Goat, Trigger Hippie, Eugene's Terry, Ambrosius McClellan, Daniel Stanton, Martinez B. Young, and also Hans Fagellen, Sebastian Mizon, and Samuel Schlick for supporting the channel.